Right, okay, well I'll go and try and find the Bazzi then. Just saying where this Isham's reach is. If I'm going to go up against the Bazzi, you're going to have to jump out into the void. It's only fair. Right, let's make sure. Cockpit canopy repair selected. Check. Heat sinks. Check. New pair of pants. Check. Oh, they should be on standby. Yeah, get ready for a brown alert. Okay. Let's find me a threat six. Oh, first one. It's uh, f what they call fate. Threat six. Smoke them if you got them. Don't smoke little thyroid scouts. Well, I hope Hundreds it's not. S I hope it's not scouts. They, they hurt with the no shields, don't they? You drop in and all of a sudden you just watch the sense disappearing. Yeah, dropping. Yep, got me one. Guns out. Weapon hey, mode. Uh, are, you, are you recording this for the squeals? I am. Oh. Well, you can watch my video back because I'm recording it. What I found with the bassies is just go. Like shit off a shovel on them, start with and just nail them, get the first heart out and then go. Don't move until the first heart's out. You'll absolutely cook the ass out of your shit in the process. But that's the first heart and that's the hardest. Normally you're laying the most shots to exert it. Well the heart's not even Thanks. exerted. Yeah, it'll take about five shots. Oh, I got it. Yeah. Hey, there it is. So I just stay stationary. Got it. One heart. One heart. I've lost lost life support, but I'm alive. <laughs> what health percent you on? Uh, I don't know. I don't want to look. I'm gonna try and repair my. God damn it! Frame shift drive's <laughs> gone as well. Not that I need that. There's no running for you. It's right on top of me, lightning in the face. 76% hull. What What do I do? Uh, lightning in the face. Shoot the next hull. Yeah, it's got shields on. Shit. Canopies. Get, yeah. Silent running. Pop a heat sink. As soon as you can, boost and start your orbit. I've lost my canopy. So the problem with the life support sort of gone away. <laughs> oh, that's good, isn't it? It's a massive swarm as well. Okay, its shields are down. Heat levels beyond operating tolerance. Warning. Heat levels beyond operating tolerance. Come on, you bitch. Danger. The heart's Danger. still in. There'll be four shots in Danger. relatively Danger. quick succession to exert it. Then three shots, then two shots. God damn it, I've hit it loads of times. Oh, there it is, it's out. Oh, come on, you bitch. Heat levels beyond operating tolerance. How many... How many hits does it take to take the heart out once it's exposed? Uh, it takes six gas. So, two shots. Two good shots with your four cannons and one. Well, I agree. I don't think I'm going to survive this. My hull's below unless, 40. Unless you can get in within, like, get up close, and then you can get it with one shot. But, like, I'll come in and I'll pop silent running before I shoot be boosting at it, so I'm going at it at about 500 metres a second, so it doesn't get a chance to lighten. Heart's gone back in. I'm at 21%, I'm getting out. Mate, mate, you haven't got an FSD. Uh, 
No, I've got an AMF for you though, so... Um, well, let's have a look. Uh, life support. Uh, where am I? Cockpit canopy. Where the fuck is it? Uh, oh no, the frame shift drive is good. 19%. Come on. It's the only go there was so marginally faster than it was all well, eh? Yeah, the speed is the thing you can't get away from it, can you? If you double back and go past it, that's how I get away <laughs> from it. Uh, uh, so, what, head straight towards it is what you're telling me? Yeah. yeah. Put silent running on and boost straight towards it, go zoom and past it. Because uh, then it would you travel in the wrong direction a little bit and give you a yeah, bit of a head start. That sounds like a do or die kind of. Oh, it is. Make sure you have flight assist off as well so you can maintain your absolute max speed. Yeah, you know, I was doing that for the running away part and dumping heat sinks like a <laughs> mad thing. Ahead of the yeah, they're a bit different to the Cyclops, aren't they? They're like ridiculously hard. I, this is the thing, it, it's like a, it's a massive jump between the Isn't Cyclops it? and the, the, the Bassies. And it's then it's just as big, if not bigger again, between the Bassie and the Medusa. Now, everyone said the Medusa will be easy when you can do a Bassie because it moves slow. Well, it might not be able to run me down and kill me as quickly, but you've got to shoot it so many more times to get it to its uh Then it's three shots to get rid of the heart at close range. Well, I guess the way to look at that encounter was I managed to get one heart. Which, uh... Yeah, go, go out and go for a sec, two hearts. Yeah, I think that's what I've got to do. I just got to say, okay, the next time I do it, I've got to do two hearts. Or do my theory on it, and how I worked out how to do them was, I'm not jumping yet. <laughs> it wins or I win, and I think it only took twelve deaths, and I had it. Only twelve deaths. Yeah. Yeah, well, I wouldn't have survived that. I might have been able to get the second heart and then die, possibly. On the first heart, before you even fire up your engines, pretty much, just because you can be within 50 metres or 100 metres of it and just blast it. Don't move at all until you've destroyed the first heart. And as soon as the first heart goes, that's when you have, like, you have to silent running at the same time as flight assist off and just nail the boost over and over to ground. But it makes it so much easier if you kill that first heart like straight away like that. And we're back on oxygen. Yeah, perhaps I'll just keep to the Cyclopses for now. Well, when you're back, you can give us a hand and then slowly ease off on the assist. <laughs> okay. 